There's still about 24 million tax returns, mine included, that have yet to get processed by the IRS. The first thing to expect this tax season is to not expect your refund anytime soon. And due to IRS staff shortages, don't even try to call and complain. According to the latest statistics, there were 32 million phone calls that they have the capacity to answer in a given year. Last year, they got 250 million phone calls. So about 90% of the phone calls to the IRS simply go unanswered. Did you or didn't you get your stimulus check? A lot of folks might not have seen that in their mail or might have thought it was junk mail. And so they now have to go through the process then of claiming that stimulus check if they didn't get it on their tax return. The child tax credit is causing confusion as well. Many people only received half last year and are now eligible for the other half. So the other half could be as much as $1,500 to $1,800 per child. Another misconception, no extra charitable donations can be written off. A standard deduction is $300 for singles and $600 if you're filing jointly, but there is some wiggle room. There's an ability to write off the donations to charity that is above and beyond your standard deduction, and it can be a deduction of another $600 for a married couple. But those donations must be made with either cash or check. Helping you through this tax season, I'm Nancy Alvarez reporting.